My name is George Woodworth and I'm from Fredericton. I'm a C5, I have a C5 spinal cord injury. Um, so my, my arms do work, but my hands, my hands don't. Uh, so I'm very limited on, um, you know, picking things up, moving things around, um, working with tools. Uh, driving is obviously a, a different uh, ball game, uh, but with, with uh, the right adaptive devices, you can do a lot of things that you really wouldn't think that you could. My first tip for anybody would be to get an accelerator guard. Um, I wrote my first car off that I had retrofitted because there, there wasn't a guard on the, on the accelerator and my foot got stuck under it and I ended up putting it off the road so I wouldn't run into anybody else. Um, try, try it. See what fits, modify it. Um, perfect example is I, I tried one steering knob on this steering wheel and it's there's no uh, power steering so it's it's quite difficult to steer especially it has a, a snowblower for the winter which makes the front end quite heavy um, so I put two steering knobs on it and it works fine just you know see what fits and, and keep working with it till you get what you want obviously uh, I've got the, the lawnmower adapted so I can I can mow my own lawn uh, I don't have to rely on my wife or, or my son to do it um, I've always liked machinery, so I mean I know it's a little piece of machinery, but it's still, you know, you still get to feel productive at the end of the day. Um, the snowblower on the front, I can come out and get on, and uh, clear the driveway and and you know, be a useful member of of my family instead of being you know being a, you know 100% drain. You bought all these retrofit uh, items, but uh, you and your son have, have put it all on yep. on and hooked it up. And, and I mean, you're spending time bonding. Oh, and, and, God, and yeah. And obviously yeah. Uh, both enjoy machinery, so that yeah. must be great. Talk about that. Well, I don't, I don't know if he enjoys it, but we, we work well at it. He's, uh, he's got a very good uh, aptitude for working with mechanical things. And, and uh, I can't tell you what a great support he's been over the last four or five years. Um, you know, we change the brakes on the car and change the oil and, and, you know, do any things like that, change the headlights and he, I mean, I just sit there and, you know, give him a tip here and there when he needs it. And, uh, you know, we, we put this, put this frame on the, on the tractor and put, put this extension on so I don't have to reach down so far to do it and I mean you know besides you get to spend quality time with your boy you know that's nothing nothing better than that oh it's independence you said it in your question I mean it's it's uh, you know the, it's powerful just to you know I need I need help getting in the car but once I'm in the car I'm in my element I can go where I want and do what I want and um, I mean I've, I've driven down to to Halifax to pick my wife up from the airport when when we were dating just on my own and I mean that was that was an experience for me. If it's something that you want to do all you need is I imagination and I mean I, I had never heard of anyone retrofitting a, a lawn tractor but it's something that I knew I could do and I knew that once I you know got on it and had the right adaptive equipment it's something that I could enjoy and it would take a load off of off of my family that I can do the work myself. Um, if you want it, do it. Build it. Find a way. Justin Marshall, Ability to Brunswick, Fredericton.